A talented local photographer is using his work to inspire others. He spent the last 65 years capturing the historic pieces inside the walls of the Henry Ford Museum building and archive. Seven Action News photojournalist Mike Glover introduces us to the man behind the camera. My name is Rudolph Theodore Rosiska, but basically I go by Rudy. I've been uh, doing photography since 1957 here at the museum. When I first started, there were still photographers shooting 8 by 10. That's 10 inches wide, 8 inches high sheet of film. I read some books and magazines, uh, photo magazines, watched what they were doing and picked it up and I enjoyed doing it and then it was collection after collection. Yeah, it's all digital. I'm doing it for the for archival use and for history. I do the pictures so that you can look at them and maybe a, hopefully a hundred years from now you can look at them and say, oh yeah, I remember seeing something about this. Everything about that object, it's documented. You can go through a whole file and look at them and find out what his piece is. Oh, yeah. That Kennedy car, well, Everybody remembers that day that was alive then. Of course, they wanted interior shots. Well, you got to get in the car to shoot pictures. So there I was sitting in the back seat just to be in that car. You go like, wow, I'm in this car. No one else is allowed in this car. And there's a lot of things in this collection where I get to touch, handle, and work with where other people, you know, they're on the other side of the glass wall. You know, the chair, let's say, the Lincoln chair. And the original one, was taken when I first started here is this picture right here. They bring the chair out and they set it down and I went like, oh my goodness, that's the real chair there, you know. It was a great picture and we used it for postcards for a number of years. 1957 till presently and I'm still shooting and I don't plan on retiring yet. I just keep moving and I tell people I climb ladders almost every day. Work basically keeps me young and, and it keeps me going, really. I, what would I do at home, paint walls? <laughs> It's only so many walls, right? Yeah. <laughs> In Dearborn, Mike Glover, 7 Action News.